uh, in the previous lecture we have designed the half adder now we are in this lecture we are going to design a full adder so we'll see how to design a full adder here so now before going to designing a full adder we need to know the specifications so here they uh, said that a full adder is developed to overcome the drawbacks of half adder circuit it can add to one bit numbers a and b and a carry c the full adder is a three input and two output combination circuit means in my previous case what i did i have added only two bits but here i am going to add three bits now step one what i have here is identify the number of inputs and outputs so i am identifying the inputs as three that i am taking as a comma b comma c are the three inputs and outputs are not going to change they are two that is sum and carry okay now second step what we have here is i need to draw a truth table for the given specifications now sum a plus b plus c that is 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0 and 0 plus 0 plus 0 when it is 0 the carry is also 0 here 0 plus 0 plus 1 is a 1 carry is 0 0 plus 1 plus 0 is 1 carry is 0 0 plus 1 plus 1 is a 0 that is 1 plus 1 is 0 and carry is 1 1 plus 0 plus 0 is 1 and carry is 0 1 plus 0 is 1 1 plus 1 is 0 and carry is 1 1 plus 1 is 0 and that 0 plus 0 is 0 and you have a carry 1 triple 1 means that is 1 plus 1 is 0 0 plus 1 is 1 and you have left over with 1 carry so now I have generated my truth table for the given function now the next step what we have is I need to go for like uh, designing the circuit and simplification now uh, whatever I have here is from this I need to identify the given expressions that is sum is equals to what I have here is that is a bar b bar c plus a bar b c bar plus a b bar c bar this is next one is a bar sorry a b c now this sum is having four product terms that is four min terms now these four min terms are nothing but this is almost equals to this is equals to your a exclusive b exclusive c so if i want to represent using your xor gate i can directly use this one if you want that we can even cross verify by expanding this one i'll be getting the above four terms means if i expand let us see now how to expand the sum term that is a exclusive b exclusive c whatever you are having that implies that a b bar plus a bar b exclusive c that is a b bar plus a bar b whole bar into c plus a b bar plus a bar b into c bar now if i expand this one using your de morgan theorem now what i have here is a b bar whole bar into a bar b whole bar into into c plus here if i distribute it a b bar c bar plus a bar b c bar now i want to expand this one so what i have here is that is a bar plus b into a plus b bar into c so if i multiply these two what i am going to get here is a into a bar is 0 plus a bar b bar c plus a b c plus what are the terms you are having here that will be repeated that is a b bar c bar plus a bar b c bar so here what are the four terms i got this is one abc which is here and now that is a bar b bar c a bar b bar c so this is one term which is here and next one is a b bar c bar this is the third term 
and fourth term is a bar b c bar that is fourth term so i can replace my sum term using your xor gate now coming to the carry let us see what exactly a carry is now uh, we'll see the carry term here now the carry term in my carry 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 whatever i have here is that is a bar b c first term next one is a b bar c plus next one is a b c bar plus a b c there are four terms what we have in your carry so i can simplify my carry term using your k map but i cannot simplify my sum term so what i do next is in the next step i'll be drawing the block diagram and simplifying using your k map then building the circuit now first drawing the block diagram full adder is having three inputs a b and c and two outputs one is sum the other is carry that is full adder now uh, for simplification of your carry carry simplification i am taking uh, the term carry is equals to whatever we are having the terms what we have is a bar b c plus a b bar c plus a b c bar plus a b c right now what i do is i am taking a three variable key map and simplifying that one so a b c 0 1 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 now 0 1 1 0 1 1 means here that is 1 0 1 1 0 1 means here 1 1 0 1 1 0 is here and uh, remaining is this one so i can group these two I can group these two and I can group these two right now here this term is what we have is a c now this term is a and b now the term what we have here is that is b c so my carry carry is equals to a b plus a c plus b c this is what the we are having for your carry and my final step whatever i have here is drawing the circuit now i am taking a b and c now a b c right now a b and c if i give it your xor gate that will become your sum and now for carry what are the terms we are having for your carry that is a b a b1 and gate next one is a c Next one is BC. So these three I am giving it to OR gate to generate the carry. So this is how we are designing our full adder when given specifications are very clear. So when the specifications are given, we can uh, design any type of combinational circuits so thank you for watching